So there's a new episode of our new upcoming episode. Let's take a coffee first. <laughs> so we have some coffee. Thank you. That's nice. Anyway, I had this new project about energy and stuff. Now I found an internet that there is a good ash and carbon um, battery. So we have a big pipe bit over here. It's like a rocket stove. It's sucking in a lot of stuff and burning it completely. Blah blah. But you get a lot of ash around it. So I thought that's an idea to make some energy out of it. So. I made a wood ash battery. And let's take a little oh, closer to the fish tank inside. This is a bio box made of and still growing. Yeah. I have to leave on it. Anyway, it's a nice thing. It's green. Got a little bit bugs inside here. Look at him. Bugs. And the fish. Need to clean the window thing. Should I do that? Quite relaxed. I'm growing. Hard fish. <laughs> so let's go to the battery. So back to basic. I uh, made some mud batteries. Started just with putting ground into a cup, um, put a graphite core, uh, not graphite, it's like a pencil core, like this one, into the into the mud with some aluminium foil and it has a little voltage now with one, two, three, four, five packs later we didn't have enough energy so we made our bigger acute packs. So these made like a little bit of 3 volts and now they are disintegrated like <laughs> copper is totally wasted somewhere it's totally green like here you see the corrosion of the salts and stuff and blah blah and it didn't do it quite well but it lit a little lead then I made a version out of this one this is uh, uh, the mud battery with the same graphite core underneath and on top of it we have uh, one in the water as you can see uh, this one didn't produce as much as voltage but i can show you so we're back again so there's a little bit less voltage to lit up a light even with the uh, uh, jewel teeth we made it so the next step was uh, for the kids for the project to make electricity was to put the wood ash into a aluminium container with a little bit of charcoal on top of it and mix it with some vinegar and salt and water now we had some voltage I'll show you now as you can see here we have the things plugged on catching on the aluminium and we have like a 0.7 volt out of the wood ash and the aluminium and the potassium what's in the wood ash so and the common stuff now the thing is it's an aluminium air battery that we made here and it runs a lot with the visual bit over here we made an one it's very bright so it's nice and this is a, a little candle holder wax candle holder we put in ash carbon on top of it, hooked up on the jewel teeth, and then we have light, so success, I'm gonna make this with kids and I think it's gonna be nice for them. So you can recycle also your burned off in candles. 